a cheerful welcome to all of you in this online maths lesson for second class today we are going to do some mcqs which will help you in your learning outcome exercises let's start our lesson for today complete the pattern here we have some shapes and a blank at the end of the pattern we have to fill it with a particular shape to complete the pattern the four options are option 1 is a triangle option a is a triangle and option b is a circle option c is a square and option d is a five sided figure a pentagon we have to choose one correct option look carefully students actually this pattern is a repetition of group of three shapes first is a triangle then a circle and then a square again the same group is repeated triangle circle and square the next will be triangle circle and then it's a blank so the blank is for a square yes option c is the correct option we will fill this blank with a square and put a tick mark at option c replace the question mark with correct object it is again a pattern of some stationary objects and here we have a question mark in between the pattern we have to replace the question mark with correct object and complete the pattern option a is a sharpener option b is a pencil option c is a book and option d is a pen let's look at the pattern carefully students a sharpener a pencil and a book then again the same group is repeated the first thing is sharpener then the pencil and then a book so for the third time again there is a sharpener and then a question mark so the question mark is the place for pencil and the pattern is complete option b pencil is the correct option and we have to place a tick mark at option b our next question is which shape will complete the pattern some figures and a blank at the end is given we have to find the correct figure and complete the pattern we have four options we can see clearly it is a group of four that is repeated first shape is a rectangle second is a five sided star third is a four sided star and fourth shape has many sides we will fill the blank with the shape having many sides it is at option c and the pattern is complete now so option c is the correct option complete the pattern it is a pattern of some arrows and these arrows are arranged in upward and downward directions there is a blank and to fill in the blank we have four options we will select the correct option for this look carefully you can see the first two arrows are placed in an upward direction then the two arrows are downward the next two arrows are upward the next two arrows are again downward and then again the two arrows are upward now it's turn for two arrows that will be placed downwards so option c is the right option and it will complete the pattern correctly it is a correct option now it's homework time kids hope all these patterns are clear to you you have to revise these exercises at your home in addition you have one more question to do as your homework and the question is pick the odd one out the first is a mango then a lady finger then a bunch of grapes then a watermelon and then an apple choose the correct option and put a tick at the odd one take good care of yourself stay tuned to your online studies goodbye thanks